Hey y'all, Half Mile Sniper here and we are back on the range today. And today we are gonna try out the little contraption I made. So let's head on down and show you what we got and we'll get started. While we're doing this, don't forget, sit back, kick your feet up, enjoy the ride. Well, you make a target stand. We got a brake rotor, we got a scrap steel. I did get a piece of a one inch black pipe. I had the PVC. I had some two inch fire hose. I had some $12 pieces of Walmart AR500. Got them at different levels. Looks like they'll swing pretty free. Yep. I forgot, you got to have the tools to do it too. But, time tools, junk, we can make something. Alrighty, so what we have here, we have my Walmart AR500s on the fire hose. Looped over the PVC pipe on the stands that I made after I did the brake job on the truck. And let me tell you, those brake rotors were a heck of a cardio workout getting them from the truck down here to the target line. It's a long hump. But I'm going to get the uh, target cam set up and we're going to shoot my 223 on these from the 100 yard line. See what kind of swing we get off of them. Stand by. All right. Well, we've got. target cam set up down there and we've got our swinging target set up down there as I was walking away the target cam battery decided it was going to die right then we caught that that's a good thing so let me get this set up kind of where I want it. Okay. We're charged. We got 10 rounds of 64 grain gold dot. Got it all the way up on four power. And we've got our little steel swingers down there. Let's see how they work. Oh yeah. That thing did a full flip, I believe. Long one didn't. Maybe they're not doing a full flip. There we go. Got it swinging. Made the flip. Cool. I should try that again. See if we can get the little one to go all the way around. There we go. Nothing. 
nice. I think I jerked the trigger on that last one. Cool. Ah. You can see how cold and miserable it is out here today. Might as well take some paint with us. Let's run down there and take a look at those swinging targets and see how they held up real quick after uh, 19 hits, I think, because I think I missed the last shot. We'll know better when we review the footage. Bring it back in a second. Well, 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 well. Considering how fast I was shooting that, that's an okay group. However, I don't think that carriage bolt survived the hit. I'm going to have to see about finding another carriage bolt because that one's going to come loose. Yeah, that's not good. So each of these should have 10 hits if I hit them all. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'm not sure what sheared the uh, bolt off. Well, maybe, it, maybe I wasn't even on them. Don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I only shot 20 rounds and I got 10 hits on each, so maybe I didn't miss. I don't think I got 11 rounds in a 10 round magazine. I don't still. I think I'll hit it with some fresh paint. See if I have any more uh, 223 ammo. Got a little bit of lead splatter there. The PVC looks like it's holding up. Got a little lead splatter there. Okay, so those are 223s on the Walmart AR-500 is leaving little dimples. I don't know if they're showing up now in the uh, since they've been painted or not. But for twelve dollars, not bad. Okay, cool. Let me go check see if I have some more uh, two two three. I wanna wanna rip through that again real quick. Well, unfortunately, I don't have any more two two three ammo in the truck. Thought I did, but I don't. But we know the swinger works. It works better than I thought it would. The PVC, I was really worried was gonna get shredded. Uh, there's hardly any splash or splatter hitting the PVC, so that's good. This should, uh, this swinger should last quite a while, I think. So, we have the join button. It's down below, over here somewhere. If y'all are inclined to join in to the little crew I've called the Half's Wits, I would appreciate it because any proceeds from that are going to go towards more equipment, bring y'all better videos. Hopefully, I'll be able to uh, get some additional cameras, new computer, something to help me render videos quicker because the computer I'm working on a bit on the slow side. It's getting the job done. Half Mile Sniper, I want to appreciate each and every one of y'all watching, liking, commenting. The likes and the comments really help the algorithm to recommend my videos to other people who maybe don't watch them. I appreciate the help y'all are giving me. Until next time, this will be Half Mile Sniper saying, keep shooting, stay safe, and we'll catch you next time.
Good.